Hi everyone, today I am doing a nude makeup tutorial. This is a really soft and natural look that you can wear for pretty much any occasion. All the products that I've used in this video are available online at nika.com and currently nika.com is having a sale so you can get all these products at 15% off. I'm going to put all the links in the description box below. Getting started with the makeup, first I'm going to use concealer and I'm using the L'Oreal True Match Concealer today. The reason I'm using the concealer before foundation is because this shade has a slight orange tone that really helps in correcting the darkness that I have. So as you can see I've used it under my eyes, around the nose and around the mouth as well. You can also use it on your lids if you have pigmentation in that area. This is a liquid concealer so it blends really easily and very seamlessly into the skin. The shade I've used here is called N45 and this is a shade that should match a lot of medium skin tones. Next I'm going to use foundation and I'm using the ZA Perfect Fit Liquid Foundation. This is a water based foundation, it's really light on the skin, it's oil free, it doesn't make your skin oily or greasy and it stays really well. This is a light coverage foundation so it looks pretty natural on the skin. I'm just applying a very thin layer just to even out my skin. To set my concealer and foundation, I'm using the L'Oreal Infallible Powder. I'm just using a very light layer of this just to set the foundation and concealer and to make it last longer. It also helps in controlling oil and since I have oily skin, a compact or a pressed powder is a must have for me. For my cheeks, I'm using the blush Creamy Cinnamon. This is by Maybelline and this is a very natural color that adds just a hint of warmth to the cheeks, doesn't add a ton of color and it's completely matte so it looks pretty natural on the skin. And for my eyes, I'm going to use this eyeshadow quad by Maybelline. Taking the lightest color, I'm applying this under my brow bone in the inner corner of my eye. And I'm also applying this along my cheekbones just to add a little bit of glow. I'm then taking shade number 2 from the quad and applying it all over my lid. This is a soft gold color that adds just a hint of shine to the lids. These are not very pigmented eyeshadows, they are slightly on the sheerer side so they are perfect for a nude look. Next I'm going to take the darkest color from this eyeshadow quad and this is a soft bronze color. I'm using this shade along my upper lash line as well as my lower lash line and this is just going to add a bit of definition. Next I am using L'Oreal Paris Kajal Magic. This is a soft black kajal and because it's not super pigmented and super creamy, it's perfect for a nude look. I am just applying this very close to my upper lash line. I am then using a sponge tip applicator just to smudge that kajal slightly because I don't want a very harsh black line. I am also using the kajal along my upper waterline. This is just going to add a bit of volume to my lashes. And the last step is mascara. I am using the Maybelline Colossal Volume Express Mascara. But first I am going to curl my eyelashes. The reason I like this mascara is because it gives a very believable natural looking volume. It doesn't clump your lashes, it doesn't give a spidery look. It does lengthen and volumize but still gives a soft and natural look. Coming to the last step, that is the lips, I'm going to use a tinted lip balm. This is Spicy Cinnamon from the Maybelline Baby Lips range. This is from the Spiced Up range which is a special collection for India. This is a sheer brown colour that looks really natural on the lips but adds just a tint of colour. And that is the finished look, I hope you enjoyed this video. This is a really easy and wearable look that anyone can do. All the products that I've used here are available online at nika.com at 15% off so don't forget to check out the sale. Thank you so much for watching and I'll be back with another video soon.